Hi, I'm Simon Metcalf. I've loved cars for a long time. I mean a long time. Oh, Simon. Trouble is, they're not terribly environmentally friendly, which is a problem for someone like me, who also loves nature. Then, three years ago, I saw this. Old cars, new cars, doesn't really matter. I can convert anything. I was dumbfounded. I didn't know that electric vehicles were possible. I certainly didn't know that people were converting their own. But, armed with these two facts, what I did know was that I was going to do it too. I informed my friends and family of this, and their confidence was... non-existent. But I was determined, so I enrolled in physics to learn about electricity and hung out at a repair shop to learn about cars. Finally, it was time to begin. I bought a car that almost worked. I think, I think this is just its general I'm upset with you sound. Took out the engine. Cleaned it up. And figured out how to fit all the new components inside. It's not quite done yet, but it should be in a couple of weeks. This car will reduce my carbon footprint in a number of ways. The whole process is recycling since I'm giving an old body new life. The new motor is electric, which means that in addition to not burning gas, it is more energy efficient and it doesn't require motor oil or antifreeze. It's coupled to a single speed transmission, which means no clutches to replace, and it's capable of regenerative braking, which saves on brake pads. I'm using lead-acid batteries, which are very easy to recycle, and I've outfitted them with desulfating units, which should extend their lifespan. I've also had an electric meter installed in my garage, so I'll be able to monitor exactly how much power the car is using. This project has taught me a lot. I'm currently studying engineering so that someday I can create green technology instead of just using it. I've had a lot of fun figuring out how to make my car work, but I'd love to see how the professionals do it.